Let's go. Woohoo! Caught on camera. <laughs> oh, well, he's bleeding a brain. Boom. All right. Take three, specialized shoes, action. Hello and welcome. Today we are talking about the specialized 2FO shoes. Look, it says it right there, 2FO. Uh, but today I want to talk about these, tell you kind of some of the features uh, and how I liked them. Okay, they're 347 grams, so they're a pretty light shoe. Uh, they do have really good venting through the, the toe here. The side and the tongue are all meant to uh, keep some airflow going. So they are a cool shoe and they're a light shoe. One of the things they updated from last year to this year is that they put more space between these uh, these knobs here uh, versus this older model was kind of tighter. I like the space between there because the pins fall in there and you do get a little bit of float without the shoe necessarily sticking hard. Some of the other shoes with a flat sole, um, that's meant for the, the pin to dig into there and really stick to the shoe. I'm not a huge fan of that. I like to have a little bit of, a uh, little bit more control over the feet, you know, if I want to kick out and do a one footer. Ugh. Pretty grippy. The next thing is, uh, this fat flashy red specialized color. No, they come in two colors. They come in a, a black, which I would have loved to get, but I went down to Mojo Wheels. Those guys down there set me up with this. This is the only color they had in the size. They do have a clip-in version of this. It's pretty cool. So it's a little more of a casual shoe, but with that clip-in option. Last year, I was having a lot of foot pain. It's been kind of getting worse and worse and worse in the uh, arch of my foot. So I want to get rid of the Vans and go with a flat pedal shoe instead of clips and get uh, get something that's stiff through the center of the shoe. The main difference between a running shoe and a cycling shoe um, is that it's stiff here, so as you're riding, you're not flexing uh, at the pedal. Like, this is your classic Vans, you know, I can fold this in half. That's the flex test. This, a lot stiffer in there. That stiffness is going to be the deciding factor whether you like this shoe or not because the stiffness, like some people like to have a little bit of wrap around the pedal. Um, that gives a little bit more feel so you don't get that wrap around the pedal. Uh, so it may, you may lose a little bit of feeling but gain some support. I've ridden these for the last year. I think they're a great value, 150 bucks uh, and they're going to be great for trail riding, downhilling, dirt jumping, enduro. BMX climbing trees Dude These shoes pump tires and look it's got one little red one right there one little red one see One thing is uh, if you're walking through the house the They will leave streak marks on your floors if you have like hardwood floor linoleum Luckily they scrub right up. Not too bad, pretty quick. Just be careful. You don't want to piss mom off. Roommate, whatever, may get upset if you go skipping through the house and leaving black marks everywhere. I think they're great, especially if you want to try flats. Um, that's another thing. My next video is gonna be about these extra large pedal innovation pedals. So that's gonna be the next review I'm gonna be doing. Uh, so check it out.